Hi, I'm Martin from East Coast Fiberglass Supplies. During the winter months, we occasionally receive calls from our customers who have experienced the resin part of our kits either crystallizing or becoming congealed. This, however, is a normal occurrence in epoxies uh, which have been exposed to cold temperatures, either in storage or during transit when the product's being delivered. So I'm going to show you how to identify the crystallization. So if you take your resin, and it appears quite thick, just have a look at it, and you'll see these little kind of white crystals. They look like bits of grains of salt. In the worst case scenario, the resin will just not move at all. Uh, just like with water in a freezer, ice crystals will begin to form as the water changes to ice. This is the same with epoxy. As epoxy start to crystallize, you will see these little white granules or in the worst case scenario, the epoxy will look foggy, milky, or solidified altogether. So why has this happened? Well, data sheets will often tell you how to store the resins and the hardness and at what temperature. Although we as a supplier follow these recommendations, the epoxy can still be exposed to cold during transit, which is beyond anyone's control. Also, it could be that the user has stored the product in a cold shed or garage over a period of time. Crystals can be eliminated by increasing the temperature of the liquid resin to about 50 degrees C until all signs of the crystals are gone. Usually this can be done by resting the epoxy on a radiator. Check the material at 10 minutes, 20 minutes and at 30 minute intervals. Typically it takes only 20 to 40 minutes to eliminate the crystals and fully return the epoxy to the clear liquid. Allow the resin to cool at room temperature, then proceed to use as normal. So hopefully that's give you an insight of what crystallization is and help you to prevent it and how to fix it. As always, if there are any questions, you can give us our tech line a call on 0191 497 5134.